everyone, let's talk Warzone. You've seen how we're pouring it all into the Cold War multiplayer experience. Let's confirm it right here, right now. Black Ops Cold War will also usher in the next evolution of Call of Duty Warzone, continuing and expanding the blockbuster Battle Royale free-to-play experience. And it'll be a true evolution, with Warzone not merely picking up where the modern warfare climax left off narratively, but also interweaving the themes, locations, weapons, and vehicles of Black Ops Cold War right into the action. Cold War and Warzone will also share post-launch content from a narrative standpoint across both the Battle Pass system and Item Shop content. This interlinks Call of Duty ways that evolve the Warzone experience while delivering jaw-dropping moments. So yeah, you can expect some surprises along the way. One surprise we're avoiding is the feeling of starting over. It's important to us that you can still use your characters, weapons, and progression-related items. Which is why investment and progress in Cold War is reflected in Warzone. While these are two very big games, from the beginning they've been built to work together. Your player experience is everything to us. So we're making sure Black Ops Cold War and Warzone share progression. With much of your previously earned Modern Warfare content, from weapons to cosmetics, still available for use in both Warzone and Modern Warfare. We're collaborating with our studio partners across Call of Duty to preserve continuity while building a new chapter of Warzone that'll immerse you into all of the best elements of Black Ops Cold War. That's multiple studios totally committed to continuing this new tradition of insanely fun, absurdly accessible Warzone action. We can't wait for you to see how Verdansk and all of Call of Duty will evolve the year ahead. But that sense of interconnectedness extends beyond just Warzone. That's why I'm excited to confirm that Black Ops Cold War will not only support cross-platform play and progression, but will also deliver cross-generation play to the game. That's because Black Ops Cold War is, at its heart, a connected experience. And playing together on whatever platform you prefer only betters that experience. Cross-play and cross-progression across current and next-generation systems across all modes. That won't be easy, but it's worth it to allow fans who have never had a chance to play together to squat up and deploy, no barriers between them. And with the Battle Pass system delivering a steady stream of post-launch content, Black Ops Cold War will be the very first cross-platform, cross-generation Call of Duty experience, making it the deepest game in franchise history. Vaughn, where do we go next? Yeah, Miles, on the subject of platforms, we've got a very special guest. Hey, what's up, Van? I'm Jeff of Linux. We are extremely excited and proud to bring Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War to battle and to lead PC development. PC continues to be a critically important pillar of game development for the Call of Duty franchise. In addition to the major improvements we have made to Call of Duty PC, that, including on cap frame rates, high refresh rate support, and customized field of view, we're always looking for ways to improve features and customizable settings. One of the biggest improvements this year is that the Black Ops engine now runs on DirectX 12. This has led to a huge improvement in terms of performance and latency reduction. For players who prioritize immersive gameplay, we have a great partnership in detail great race effects, performance accelerating deep learning super sampling or DLSS, and Refix latency optimization technology. We will implement ray trace shadows and ambient occlusion to improve the quality of light shadow and sunlight shadow. This improves surface and contact detail and fixes problems associated with traditional shadow mapping techniques like aliasing, flickering, and disconnected shadows. Also, we will be implementing AI power DLSS so players will be able to increase their frame rate while maintaining the visual quality of the game. For players looking for better responsiveness, We've integrated the Reflex Low Latency technology to lower system latency. This combines both GPU and game optimization. We're also happy to announce that Reflex will be coming to Call of Duty Warzone in the future. We have so much more to talk about, but right now I would like to hand it back to David Vandor. Bye. 